Welcome back everybody. This is Makeup Gamers Club. I'm bringing you another unboxing today. First of all though, I want to give a shout out to Luis for getting first place in this week's tournament. Um, we're, I'm thinking about doing um, a video every Tuesday and announcing who got first place during this last week's tournament. So this week it was Luis. He's been on a roll. If anybody thinks they can uh, dethrone him, come on by for one of our tournaments and we are glad he will gladly serve you. Um, so shout out to him um, from me and uh, Shadow of Gamers Club, which Shadow participated this past week. But anyway, let's get back to it. Legendary Duelist, White Dragon Abyss. We're going to open up this set, and I am very excited about this one because as everybody knows, I run Blue Eyes, and I'm a big fan of Blue Eyes. So let's do it really quick. It's not going to be a long video. I just want to do something for you guys because I do appreciate it. So everything we do here, I do it for you guys. So I want to bring you guys some content. I wanted to open one up. Now, to remind everybody, we are at 4525 South Main Street, gamersclub.tcgplayerpro.com or gamersclub.com. Everything that I'm going to be if, uh, unboxing here is going to be for sale. So this is not my personal stuff. This is going to be completely for sale. So I want to be honest. I don't know exactly what it is. Now, I know what the high price cards are, but I don't know what I need out of here. I haven't researched the set that much. So, a rare. Everything else is common. So, basically, I guess the best you can get out of a pack is rare, one rare. Not everything is shiny like some sets. Oh, Cyber Twin, Cyber Hand, Photon Change. Okay, cool. All right, next pack. Again, guys, if you guys want to come down to the tournament, it is on Sundays at around 4.30 p.m. Black wing stuff, chaos form. Okay, so we got Rage with Eyes of Blue and Super Strident Blaze. Nice. Okay, I like those. So I'll put that there. Super, huh? It's pretty cool. I like that. I don't know what it does yet. Let's see. Wanted to do this for you guys. Oh, bingo machine. I guess this is one of the good ones, I think. Um, I want to do a little bit something because I know I've been absent off of YouTube for a little bit. It's just for those who know, who are in the know, I've been trying to work hard to get OTS for Yu-Gi-Oh, which is not as simple as other companies, but I'm almost there. And I think I'm going to start having a little bit more time to bring you guys more content. I do appreciate it. People have been subscribing, and it's wonderful when you guys leave a comment. So if you guys can do me a favor, um, if you can, please, I would greatly appreciate that. Just share this video with anybody you think might have a, you know, a passion for Yu-Gi-Oh or a liking for Yu-Gi-Oh or card games in general. Um, we're trying to get as many subscribers as we can. We will do a giveaway as soon as we reach that goal. It's been taking a little bit longer than I would like it to, but that's all right. You know, we're a bit of an exclusive um, club here, community. And everybody that's in the community with us that comes in and plays is usually pretty cool, pretty chill, pretty mellow. Um, and I really like that. I appreciate that about everybody. So, again, that's why I'm doing this. I don't necessarily have to open up an entire box. But I figured, hey, let's put something up for YouTube for you guys. And I know you guys, oh, Blue Eyes Solid Dragon. I don't even know about this dragon. Huh. Wow. Negation. Nice. I wonder how that's going to change up uh, Blue Eyes. Uh, let's see. If it's good support or not. Photon change. I do need that uh, one photon lead, I believe it's called. I'd like to use that in my blue eyes deck. But anyway, let's see. Start off with the right side first. Put that there. Photon Vanisher. So there's a lot of photon stuff in here, huh? Okay, Cyber Repair, repair Plant. And Abyss Actor. See what else we get now. Cyber Dragon Dre, Blackwing 
So I guess some Blackwing stuff is in this Legendary Duelist. Last year was Joey, Blue Eyes. Oh, Ultimate Creature Destruction. Cool. You know, I'm really a sucker for these uh, Blue Eyes cards, man. That's so cool. If I don't get to play them in my um, actual deck, I will definitely add them to my binder if I can afford it. I'll try to see Super Strident Blaze. I think that's the second one of that that we have now. Oh, shit. Cyber Eternity Dragon. That seems pretty cool. Keep getting that rare. A base actor comic release. Let's see what else we got. So, we're about finished with the... Oh, nice. Dragon Shrine. That's always a good card. Um, so, I like the way that Konami is going nowadays. Oh, Power Bond. Cyber Twin Dragon Abyss. Actually, I might put that to the side because that's an okay card. Um, but I like the way they're going because it makes the cybernetic revolution is that good yeah let's see um because it makes the game more of a level playing field in some ways for those who can't afford the the high price cards which the argument can be made either way and i understand why chaos form okay people are going to be looking for that well tom vanisher um but to me, I'm okay with the whole, you know, Konami's trying to make um, cards that cost a lot of money, kind of a thing of the, of the past. You won't be having too many of, like, the Ash Blossoms and things like that. Starleach Photon Blast Dragon. Hmm, that seems promising. I like the art at the very least. Um, I, like I said, I don't know anything about this set, so... I'm kind of just going through it, and later on I'll find out what is. And besides, um, the set is so new, prices are still fluctuating. Galaxy Knight, huh? Reminds me of Galaxy Warrior. So I'm not too worried about prices right now. And Konami, like I keep trying to complete my thought, is that Konami's going the way of like they're trying to stay away from cards that'll drive up values. And just reprint a lot of things so that um, not one thing is too expensive for any one person to buy and make the game kind of, you know, more accessible to larger audiences. And I mean, I get why some people are against that. To be honest with you, I'm not, but I'm of a different um, point of view, I suppose. So, with that said, um, I've been okay with the sets, how they've been doing lately. Oh. Blue Eyes Chaos Dragon. Been hearing a lot about that. Blue Eyes Chaos Dragon. Not Chaos Max. Maiden. She's, uh, a common now. Was she ever a common? I think so. I think there was a common, right? I think she was common when she came out of the structure. For a starter, Rage with Eyes of Blue. Nice. I'm a sucker for these blue eyes cards. I like to fiddle with them even if they're not good. Just, just because I've had a lot of iterations of the blue eyes with all sorts of blue eye support. So, that's why I keep saying that some of these will... If I get some of stuff for my own... Now, this is all for sale, so almost none of it I'm going to keep for myself. But if I get the chance, I will get some of it for myself and display it on my binder for those who want to take a look at my binder. My binder is usually something you, some people want to look at. Oh, cool. Another one of those. That power bond. Nah, it's all commons. Not bad. Some of this stuff is like really good dragon support. Things that you can play. Cyber load. Fusion, only one of these in the entire box. All right, there it is. There you have it. That's all I pulled. So I pulled Cyberload Fusion, Rage with Eyes of Blue, two of them, Blue Eyes Chaos Dragon, Galaxy Knight, 
Star Leech Photon Blast Dragon, Cybernetic Revolution, Cyber Eternity Dragon, Ultimate the Ultimate Creature of Destruction, Blue Eyes Solid Dragon, Black Wing Simoon the Poison Wind, Bingo Machine Go, and I already mentioned that one. So there you guys have it. Thank you guys for watching. I do appreciate when you guys leave a thumbs up, share it with anybody, leave a comment below, and um, of course if you're new around here. Please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and that bell so that you can get notified of anything that's going on with Gamers Club. I'm trying to be a little bit more active here and let you guys know what's going on as far as events, tournaments, um, new sets, um, and events that we might be having here. New videos, new content. We're going to try to keep up with it. As always, I really do appreciate you guys. We're at 4525 South Main Street. If you are interested in coming in, catching a duel or anything, anything that you might need here in Los Angeles, California gamersclub.tcgplayerpro.com for any singles that you might need and you're not in California you want to get something from us to support the channel that's the only way we um, get some support right now to keep bringing you this content and of course gamersclub.com you can get anything from anime stuff to some of the stuff we have here in store delivered to you a lot of the stuff on there is free shipping so please go ahead and check it out it really helps us out anyways thank you guys for watching this is makeup gamers club out